So thanks for tuning in for update three of the Aerotetris 2.8 meter SR71 Blackbird build log. Um, a bit of progress this week, not as quick as I'd hoped, lots of other things going on. I'm sure you've seen several other videos that I've published during the week, tend to publish about one per day and those do all take effort. So, um, but I've been doing bits and pieces on this and I was hoping to have the whole fuselage together, but I've actually just got half the fuselage together, one side, and that has taken enough, enough effort, believe me. So um, if you remember, I think last time I was putting the half of the cross sections together, um, like here. So basically I've got those done for both sides of the fuselage, but I've um, put one side of the fuselage together from the, I did it from the back uh, to the front from 57 all the way through to 51. And that's what I've got here. So it's long, uh, 2.8 meters. It's a seriously long model. I keep, I'm just gonna say that on each video. <clears throat> now, uh, I have made little mistakes along the way. This is the first time I've done an Aero Tetris project, but the one really frustrating thing is that I'm missing a couple of pieces. Very frustrating. So what I did was um, emailed Igor at Aero Tetris and I said, Could, can you uh, possibly cut me a couple of small pieces that I'm missing. Of course, he said, no, I can't do that. I cut the whole layer in one go. Um, so what he recommended, uh, in hindsight, what I should have done, common sense, is that you have all of the excess for each layer. After you've labeled up all of the pieces, and then you take those pieces out and you put those in a tub, you have all the excess left over. Now, inadvertently, you might, um, and not have separated out one of the pieces that you need. And he said that excess should go into a, uh, a bin bag, a bag basically, so for each layer. So you should end up with six bags. And if you're missing a piece when you do your build, then you should know which it, a layer it belonged to and you can go back to that bin bag. And if you've kept everything, then you, you shouldn't have lost it. Now, I didn't keep the excess, I've thrown it away because I'm a bit of a clean freak these days and uh, like to keep everything tidy. So that is gone uh, because I was so um, convinced that I ha will, would not have chucked anything that I needed away. So it's still possible. I might have those two missing pieces in another tub. I think it's unlikely it's possible, but it's not a disaster. I've got some, sp I've got some spare foam so I can just cut, I can just make those pieces up. As long as I'm not missing too many pieces, then I think I'll be fine. So the, uh, that's that, that's the, the uh, annoying mistake I've made during the week. But um, what else to say, joining this length of all these foam pieces together, um, you can see on the individual pieces, you have a 10 mil hole in the majority of them. So I got some one, uh, one meter lengths of 10 millimeter outer diameter carbon uh, tube from my friends at Robot Birds and use those one meter lengths to uh, put all this together and then used eight mil outer diameter carbon tube to join those one meter 10 mil outer diameter tubes together. And uh, that's that. I think that's, uh, that's good enough to now. It's gonna get, um, glass cloth put over it, it's gonna, I'm gonna glass it in its entirety. Um, but that's where we are at the moment. I've done one, that one side of the fuselage, the, uh, the cross sections for the other half of the fuselage done, and that's what I'm gonna build. Uh, I'm gonna build the other side of the fuselage this week, uh, and then hopefully towards the end of the week, glue the two halves together, and then we'll have the whole fuselage, and I can start on the wings and the, and the, uh, the engines. So that's it for this one. Thanks for watching. If you'd like to follow along on this build, then please subscribe to this Essential RC YouTube channel and you can click the bell as well. And that will mean you get notifications of anything that we upload in the future. But thanks for watching this one. See you next time.